why this program eliminates bone loss like osteoporosis and osteopenia. There are two causes of unhealthy bones in your body. One is the uneliminated acidity that causes your body to leach calcium and other minerals from your bones into your blood to buffer those acids. And number two is the poor absorption of calcium from your diet. Both of these two things are what cause bone loss and osteoporosis, osteopenia. And in this program, when you heal your bowel and body, you address both causes of bone loss. To have healthy bones, you need to have a healthy body. So go back to chapter three of my book, This Works, Crutches Don't, and go back to that diagram that explains how when acids are not eliminated from your body, they accumulate and your body starts to react differently to protect you against those. And that eventually, when you get to what I call the top of the pipe, your body starts to use the alkaline minerals in your bones to buffer those uneliminated acids. That protects you from being killed from those acids in your blood, but it does mean that your bones become unhealthy and weak in the process. The other reason that you have an unhealthy bone structure or osteoporosis or osteopenia is because one of the jobs of your gut bacteria is to digest and assimilate and absorb the calcium from the foods you are consuming. Many of you, for many years, if not decades, have been consuming foods with, rich in calcium, but you've not ab ab been absorbing the calcium that is in them, and that means you haven't been getting adequate amounts of calcium to build healthy bones in the first place. So a healthy bowel helps you absorb calcium and contributes to a healthy bone um, structure and reduces osteoporosis and osteopenia. While you're healing your bowel and body with this program, there are some crutches that will help assist with improving the health of your bones. The first one is body bentonite. Remember, bentonite is a substance that binds to acids in the blood and eliminates them from your body. By eliminating acids from your body, you're changing the pH of your blood and reducing the need for your bones to dump calcium and other minerals into your blood to buffer them. So you reduce the breakdown of those bones. But remember, bentonite is more than just a crutch. It's also a healing agent. And what makes this program remarkable is it's not just stopping the further damage and breakdown of calcium in the bones, but it actually helps to heal the bones, which are just an organ like all your other organs. Your bones are living, breathing, changing organs, and they are changing, and they can change, and they can heal. To heal an organ, you need to clear out the acidity that's causing it to be unhealthy in the first place. Something that diets, supplements, acupuncture, massage, drugs, etc. do not do. In addition to using bentonite to get the acids out of your body that causes the body to leach those minerals from your bones, it's also very helpful to take some calcium, maybe for a year or two while you're healing, uh, very easy to assimilate and absorb type of calcium. I recommend calcium citrate. So the reason to do this is because, again, it may have been years, if not decades, that you have not been getting adequate amounts of calcium into your body through your diet or you haven't been absorbing adequate amounts. And to take a, a calcium supplement, the idea is to try to help rebuild and make up for that lack and depletion that has been happening for a long time. To give your bones the materials they need to become healthy until your bowel is healthy enough to start absorbing the calcium from your food sufficiently. Because, of course, naturally you should be able to um, absorb the calcium and not have to take something. But in the meantime, calcium citrate is a great, easy to assimilate form of calcium. Many of the calciums that are sold in discount stores, drug stores, grocery stores, even in the health food store, are calciums that are very low quality, inexpensive, and difficult to absorb. The irony is that if you have unhealthy bones, you have an unhealthy bowel, and you more than anyone need to take a calcium that you can absorb. There are other forms of calcium that work as well. I'm a big fan of citrical and again, calcium citrate. Citrical is a form of calcium citrate, extremely easy to absorb, and extremely easy to find in your big discount stores like Target and Walmart, as well as in the grocery store, drug stores. Do get the maximum strength if you can, and take the strongest amount that you can, which is, again, the maximum strength. You can also find calcium citrate at the health food store. However, be careful because, for example, this one by Twin Lab says calcium citrate on the front, but if you turn it and look at the label, you'll see there's a lot of magnesium in there. 
you do not need magnesium to have healthy bones. In fact, if you add a bunch of magnesium into your diet, you are likely to have your bowels become more frequent and looser. And while that is not directly harmful, it's only harmful if you have frequent diarrhea that can lead to dehydration, but, but most of the time when someone adds in magnesium, the bowels become just a little bit looser, softer, and the danger is that it is if they blame the bowel strength or the probiotics or the bentonite for causing their stools to become more frequent or looser. And when you blame the bowel strength or the probiotics or the bentonite wrongly for causing your problems, you will fail to heal your bowel and body and heal your bones. So I do not recommend extra magnesium. You don't need it. Keep in mind that there's a big difference between healing an organ like your bones and treating a symptom like headaches or asthma or weight problems. Those symptoms are caused by an unhealthy organ, but more so they're triggered by uneliminated acids in your blood. A healthy, unhealthy organ is created by decades, often decades, of weakness and damage to an organ. So in my office, the analogy I use a lot is you might have 20,000 holes over your roof and we can quickly put a tarp on it like our bentonite and keep the house dry. We can quickly soak up the acids in the blood. Manipulating the acids in the blood can be done pretty quickly but that's not the same as fixing the holes in the roof. This program heals and fixes the holes in the roof, but it does take time to heal an organ like your bones. So if you have a diagnosis of osteoporosis or osteopenia when you start this program, give it a year or two of doing this program. Make sure you take a lot of your calcium citrate as well as aggressively heal your bowel and body and then have that test read done again. But you can't do it right away. If you feel great right away because you've taken a bunch of bentonite, that's wonderful. But feeling great right away is not the same as healing an organ. That takes time. For more information, by the way, on using calcium, you can find information in Chapter 10 of my book, This Works, Crutches Don't. A couple other things I want you to know about this, and that is number one, there are numerous studies, and they've all come to the exact same conclusion, no doubt about it, that the more acidic your diet is, the more weak your bones are, the more bone problems and osteoporosis and osteopenia that you have. So for example, soda, coffee, alcohol, sugar, processed salt, highly acidic foods, but so are animal proteins, chicken, fish, turkey, uh, beef, etc. Every study I've ever seen in the last 20 years shows the more of that that is consumed, the more osteoporosis results. Because remember, a weak organ is caused by the eventual breakdown of a, of a system due to a lot of accumulated acidity. You also hopefully know by now that when your bowel and body are not healthy, that you desire those foods, the coffees, the sugars, the alcohols, and you often need those foods. Many of you need to eat more protein to look and feel good. So it's a vicious cycle. To look and feel good, you're eating a diet that's highly acidic and damaging to your organs like your bones. This program by healing your bowel and body eventually takes you to a place where you no longer need or desire those foods. And it's another reason why this program is so valuable for healing your, your bones as well. As always, if you'd like more information on this, please go to my website at www.uniquehealing.com. You can also find information on scheduling appointments as well as a lot of other videos and um, helpful information on my blog there as well. So I hope that helps.